Hey guys, the next video in my mini series covering claims made by Hamza the Muslim apologist. In this one, it's meeting the teacher. So here he's introducing himself and why this is video number one before school is open and not the beginning of the series will forever remain a mystery. But that's why I've turned it around. But maybe he's as chaotic as the Quran and is sorting them by approximately length. But not always. <laughs> Again, several mistakes here regarding the contents. Like he can't seem to remember how many years he's been a Muslim as I hear different numbers. But that is totally irrelevant. What is relevant, however, are the immense claims. No, they, the EF Dawa apologists, are not good at what they do. I'm part of um, a Dawa team called EF Dawa. We have a subs YouTube channel, Alhamdulillah, with quarter million subscribers. So Alhamdulillah, we're good at what we do. Quite the opposite, as I have demonstrated numerous times. That's why they need to resort to censorship and underhand tactics. His arrogance here is totally unfounded. The reason for high subscriber numbers, I reckon, is due to the weakness of Islam, where the internet is bringing out one devastating blow after the other, showing that claims made by the Quran as well as by apologists are unfounded and false. Unfortunately for the followers of this book, there are no counter-arguments, so channels like SC Dawa or EF Dawa are frantically being subscribed by Muslims who can't face reality and crave comforting and confirmation, ignoring the blatantly false contents and the superficial handling of issues. He claims there's nothing he has not heard. <laughs> that, quite frankly, is impossible. I could destroy his entire belief in minutes, but that's probably why he blocks people like me and shows obvious signs of nervousness, fear, even panic at the thought of being shown to be wrong. Now, an atheist does not bring arguments against what a theist believes, but questions and challenges the claims made in the Quran or by people like him. It's a reaction in self-defense. So, no, I don't have any standard accusations or claims, just reactions to apologist claims. And no, he is deluded, thinking he is presenting anything but his own ignorance.